Okay, more back to school coverage now. Uh, in the 608, focused on back to school today as a lot of those kiddos head back. Yeah, we're heading back out to Jefferson County. Josh Breider inside the Fort Atkinson School District, talking to folks about how they're welcoming students back in. Hey, Josh. Hey, Chris and Leah, good morning to you and happy first day of school. We finally made it. It is time for a lot of kids to be heading back to their schools today, including here in the Fort Atkinson School District. We're live at Fort Atkinson High School where students will be coming back into the building and here in what, just about an hour or so, we're going to start to see the first students arriving. So a lot of excitement. I want to bring in the Fort Atkinson School Superintendent right now, Dr. Abbott this morning. Dr. Abbott, thanks for having us here. Good morning. Yeah, we are super excited. I'll tell you, September 1st, we start working day one in June getting ready to launch a new school year right here September 1st. So all of our kids, our families, our community, they're ready to go. So you have a lot of history here in the district. 26 years, right? Yeah, so, so I've been here for 26 years, so I've raised kids here as well. And uh, Fort Atkinson really celebrates public education. I'll tell you, you know, we talk about being uh, one team, one district, and one community, and that's true. When we talk about being one fort, it takes all of those um, to really come together and, and make sure that teaching and learning is the best it can be for our kids. Yeah, and after the last couple of years you guys are much more excited for this year because it's looking more normal for you you know it's really been exciting to focus on uh, the good stuff as opposed to planning for uh, the eventualities of the last couple of years so to have everyone's energy and excitement and talents focused um, in classrooms and working with kids as opposed to planning for the uh, eventualities of the last couple of years has been really awesome so for those you know teachers and parents and kids that are watching this morning you know what would be your best advice for them going into this brand new school oh, year? Just go in open-minded, be like interested, be excited, be adventurous, be inquisitive, ask questions, and really take advantage of everything that your school, your teachers, you know, the entire community has to offer. Yeah, and I mean, you guys have been busy all summer getting prepared. The school looks great. I mean, you can tell that a lot of effort goes into, you know, making back the school the experience it needs to be. Well, when we talk about one team, I mean, we're talking about everybody. We're talking about teachers, all of our staff, all of our, um, all of our administrators, everyone in the district. And I'll tell you, when it comes to all of the, the work that happens over the course of the summer, our maintenance, our custodial crews, all of those people are working tirelessly to get our facilities up and running in, in tip-top shape. Yeah, and even when we arrived around quarter to five, you had one of your facilities guys just coming out with a check on us. You can just tell there's a lot of excitement just to have people and, you know, just that freshness back here in the building. We've got really, really good people, and everyone is focused on uh, getting kids in, getting them uh, acclimated, and getting them excited about the new school year. Wonderful. Well, Dr. Abbott, happy first day of school. You did it. You're yeah. back. Well, thanks for having me. You bet. Appreciate coming out. Yeah, we appreciate your time this morning, guys. Again, a lot more fun to come here from Fort Atkinson School District. If you'd like to learn more about back to school, remember you can go to our continuing coverage page up on channel3000.com, guys. All right, Josh, Friday live in Fort Atkinson. Love the balloons. Thanks, Josh. Remember to let Josh know what inspires you in the 608. You can reach out on social media or shoot him an email for a chance to be featured.